OK, for the units I'm going to do 4 times 6, which is 24. So I put 4 in the units column and I'm going to remember that too. So for the tens column, I'll have that 2 together with 7 times 6 and 4 times 9. So that's 2, 7, 6 is 42, that's 44. 4, 9 is 36, 44 and 36 is 80. So I'll write down a 0 and I need to remember that 8 for the hundreds column. So in the hundreds column I'll have that 8. I'll also have 3 sixes, 7 nines and 4 times 1. So that's 8. 3 6 are 18, so that's 26. 7 nines are 63, plus 26 is 89. 4 ones are 4, plus my 89 is 93. So I write down the 3 and remember the 9. Now for the thousands column, I've got my 9. I've also got 2 6s, 3 9s, and 7 ones. So that's 9, plus 2 6s are 12, that's 21, plus 3 9s are 27. So that's 48, plus 7 ones are 7, so that's 55. So I write down the 5, and I remember the 5 for the next column, which is also going to have 2 9s and 3 ones. So my 5 plus 2 9s are 18, that's 23, plus 3 ones are 3, that's 26. So I write down my 6, and I remember the 2. And together with that 2, I'm also going to have 2 times 1, which is 2, so that's 4. So the answer is 465,304.